Hi everybody, it's been a really long while and as you can see, seasons have changed. I'm in another part of my messy room, but I finally, finally came around after months of finishing the book that I promised last time. It's called The Refugees by Viet Tan Nguyen, so I'll make a short book review. And I'll start by reading a little bit about the back, from the back flap. It says, Viet Tan Nguyen was born in Vietnam and raised in America, by which I assume they mean the United States of America. One day I'll make a short video about that. He is the author of The Sympathizer, which was awarded the 2016 Pulitzer Prize for Fiction. Then comes a list of the awards he has won and says that he teaches English and American Studies and Ethnicity at the University of Southern California and lives in Los Angeles. Now this book is a little precious book that I think everybody should read, if not this precise one, but at least one that has this kind of topics. It's called The Refugees and it is definitely and always about a family torn apart or having dreams and ambitions of coming in a new country or having the ghost of the past like beside your current life in a new country all the time. It is um, a collection of eight short stories and um, it's pretty straightforward to read I mean I took this long because it's me but um, it's very captivating and um, I think anybody who has any kind of migration um, will definitely find themselves or a family member in the positions that these characters find themselves in and uh, migration has occurred at all times in history but I think now um, it's gaining more momentum because of all the happenings and globalization and the currents of people moving from one place to the next. So I think this little book should definitely be in everybody's reading list to gain a bit of an insight into the struggles and the pain and the, um, just the separation of all that was you and the new you um, of so many people and how that really affects your mental well-being so um, I think especially in order to empathize and understand and maybe view the current happenings from a more humane perspective we should all definitely read this book and other ones similar to that so it's been a pleasure and I definitely recommend this one for you all right have a nice Christmas bye